So for today, we're going to be looking at the season pass for season of the Arisen. I am really excited to showcase this because I haven't even seen everything that is in this. So if you guys like the video, like, comment, subscribe really does help the channel grow. And I really do appreciate you all. But let's just get right into it. So the first one you're going to be looking at is Grand Overture. This is the new machine gun for this season. And I have been using it specifically for the first mission. And honestly, it's pretty it's pretty wild how much fun this weapon actually is. So heavy heavy slug launcher that charges when fire then fires full auto while the trigger is held. So essentially just hold down the trigger and you'll be able to shoot a lot. But once you start getting kills or even hits, if I remember correctly, then you'll actually be able to uh, activate the Omega strike land hits with the slug launcher to load missiles R press then fire to launch all missiles in a single volley. So that's the one that legitimately will fuck up people. Uh, hopefully I can show you guys a bit right now just because I have I have it, uh, recorded the first and second uh, episode of this. And again, I'm going to be real with you guys. It's absolutely wild just how much fun this weapon is. The catalyst, I haven't gotten it yet. So once I complete that, we'll obviously do a review of this. Hopefully I'm really bad at doing reviews for exotics, but hopefully I do it for this one. Uh, for sec, I'm not going to go through all of them just cause like you should know what these are. And if you don't know what they, these are, then let me know in the comments below. I'll definitely explain it to you, but we'll look at the ones that are new. So essentially like risen umbrella energy from what I know, this is where you actually come to the helm and you will be able to use that to get, uh, tools of the risen, which is basically the weapons and armor for this season so the currency of the season essentially which i'm okay with i wonder how much they're gonna give us because i'm gonna want to get a lot of weapons especially if they have really good roles which speaking of which i will have the weapons videos coming in soon again i have a lot of content that i'm gonna be just grinding through this whole like month essentially so shader is called royal die i actually do like this shader a lot it's pretty cool and I'm definitely going to try to use this in a lot of stuff. The next up is a, a finisher, which I'd love to see it. Okay, there we go. That's pretty cool. I'll probably put that on my warlock. Uh, for the next page, we have some more stuff that will help you within the game itself. We have an, a transmit effect. And would love to see. There we go not terrible in my opinion uh hands of the risen so you get the arms which is really cool not only that in the i think one of the twabs it said that this armor might be actually level like or not level but it might be higher tier so which is really good uh legs of the risen so more stuff and then you get an a vehicle more sparrow obviously and it looks fine uh definitely does not look exotic to me but i mean whatever get a sniper as well which this sniper looks fucking beefy is it an adaptive nah this should have been this should have been a heavy one but okay uh not a heavy heavy but i mean like a whatever it's called i forget aggressive frame there we go this shader is good Ooh, i might rock this shader instead because this is a good blue and gold okay i'm i'm with this one uh so 50 or 41 to 50 we get a uh, pulse rifle this is a pulse rifle not look like a pulse rifle i thought this was a scout rifle a rapid fire frame as well okay uh you get a ghost as well which this one actually does look pretty cool yeah this looks really cool because it looks like a which i'm gonna call it the enemy type, I forget. Cabal enemy type. Uh, this... Is this an ornament? No, no, this is armor. Grants additional psych psychogenic intel. That's cool. That blade on the hand is pretty cool. Not gonna lie. wonder if it's shaders will. Doesn't look terrible so far. Yeah, I think it's going to shade her pretty well. Although I don't like this tentacle thing. that It just looks dumb. Uh, boots. 
again we'll we'll be going through armor uh in a, in a different video so titans warlocks don't don't think i've forgotten about you guys we'll just we'll do that video once i get the armor for everyone which should be within the week this is the tusk armor yeah it is it looks really cool my only gripe with it is this massive fucking thing right here jesus christ but it looks cool definitely looks super cool um didn't we just look at arms oh that's the ornament okay this is an ornament again ornaments is actually going to be a little bit more difficult not difficult but it's going to be a little bit more time consuming because this one's going to take a little bit to get but again i won't be making that video so uh just stay tuned look again remember subscribe uh if you guys want to keep updated to this because i i do a bunch of this armor weapons reviews everything Oh, okay. That's going to be good for for stuff. Ooh, this looks good with this with this uh with what's oh, god damn it, with this fucking uh thing right here. Uh my my cloak. There we go. It looks good with the cloak, like really good. Okay. This is the one I'm excited for personally. The psych psionic uh stalker cloak. Oh, dude, it looks so cool. And I'm hoping the blue changes color, because if it doesn't, that's going to be a big L. But here's a helmet, Tusk Allegiance mask, which we this one doesn't have a tusk, if I remember correctly. Oh, God, that looks so good. This might be the ornament I use. Oh, wow. And then uh, this is one of the coolest helmets right now for, for hunters, I think, just because we get their helmet. This looks so fucking good. <laughs> Uh, I think I skipped a few things here and there. Uh, not really. It's just, again, uh, we're getting a bunch of upgrade modules, bright dust, uh, a lot of material stuff. Again, uh, we get a really cool emo, which I actually do think this one's really cool. Oh, wow. The startup is cool, too. Okay. And then last but not least, we get the ornament for the exotic, seasonal exotic, which I think looks really cool as well. So yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Um, yeah, I'm really excited. Uh, this season is going to be hopefully good. Uh, this expansion hopefully is going to be good. I don't want to look back at this video and be like, damn, I was really wrong. I, I want to be like, damn, I was, I was spot on because this season was really good. I want to say that. So... I just wonder how they're going to, oh, oh, okay. So yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. If you guys want to follow me on my social media outlets, links are in the description below. I thank you all for coming to this point and I'll see you guys later.